Hello all. In this video session, we will be discussing about different looping or iterative statements used in PLSQL. That is, in uh, we are we will be implementing that in MySQL. Okay. So we have three loops or three looping statements. First one is loop, second one is while, and third one is repeat. Okay. And in case of a loop, loop doesn't have a termination statement, so we have to write some if else statement so that when the termination condition reaches we can terminate the loop in case of while while is an again entry control loop similar to what we learned in C program language whereas a repeat is an exit controlled loop okay now we will go and see the syntax of different looping statements again these are all written inside functions and this is the looping part this is the example of loop statement okay so in every looping statement first we will write the name of the loop in this example it is given as my loop then colon then which looping statement you are going to use the keyword of that particular looping statement okay so here we are looking at the example of loop so my loop colon loop and loop doesn't have any termination condition so we'll write it with the help of a if statement so i'm writing if n greater than zero then uh, perform operation like result equal to result into n and then decrement the value of n by one okay that is set n equal to n minus one if n is greater than zero then only these statements work otherwise we will leave from this my loop okay that's why it is given us else leave my loop okay then the if statement is ended so we have given end if semicolon then after that end loop the name of the loop that is my loop semicolon okay so this is a simple function to find factorial of a number using loop and as i have been mentioning the syntax is loop name colon then loop keyword then the if condition and inside if condition we will write the statements which we want to do when this particular condition is true that is when the end is not reached and if this condition becomes false that is termination has reached then we will be executing this else statement and inside which we will be giving leave my loop which will leave from this particular loop okay so since we have given if here we have to give end if here okay since we have given loop here we have to give l loop then loop name here okay so here i am using the convention of uh, giving loop name so i think it will be better the same format is uh, written for while and repeat only some uh, changes are there again in case of while my loop colon while then the condition then we have do keyword okay while condition do that is while n greater than zero do then the statements that we want to do that is our loop body of the loop okay that is a set uh, result equal to result into n and then we are decrementing the value of n by giving set n equal to n minus one and finally end while then name of the loop while loop or the particular looping statement that is my loop okay so this is in case of while and in case of repeat repeat is an exit control loop and here also first we will give the name of the loop that is my loop colon repeat then set result equal to result into n and set n equal to n minus 1 which is the body of the loop and then that we are checking whether we have reached the end or not okay so here we will give until n less than or equal to 0 so when this condition becomes true then it will exit okay in the case of while when this condition is true then the body will be executed but in the case of repeat when this condition becomes after until there will be a condition and when this condition becomes true it will go out of the loop okay so here uh, after writing all these statements since we are writing the repeat statement we have to write end repeat the name of that particular repeat statement okay so that's how we write different 
looping statements that is loop statement while statement and repeat statement okay Let's try out these examples in hd sql okay thank you